It's going to bring up a fourth down. Welcome, welcome back to the one. Warriors Stadium. Two, they got a yard. We already started the fourth in the last down quarter, down and we were Thompson. underway. They're going to put this ball away. I was surprised by that play call. Hughes condensed it. Tried to run the ball right up the teeth of the defense. I was really surprised that that was the call coming out of the quarter. They have been unable to convert on their last eight third downs. Get much more manageable than that. John Allen McGuire. The Auburn commit is set to punt away. Taylor set to receive. Taylor, fair catch at the 25. The college football season kicks off in just a couple of days. We've got the first game of the year on ESPN and the app. Florida State, Georgia Tech, New Eastern. Like right over there, I see one of the drum majors for the marching band. Today's coverage at 9 a.m. Eastern. ESPN and ESPN News. Six times the last 12 years of college football game has been played in Ireland. This one's a good one. Seven seven race and Thompson. Mason has not scored since the opening drive of that first quarter. Grayson do offensively here. Go back to the attack in the middle of the field. That kind of got away from that. You had a lot of success, whether it was running the ball or passing it over the middle. There it is. That went right back to him. Turner closing out of the first down. Going to bring up a third down and one as Turner. You know what? I think this field. game will last until 10:30. Actually, again. touchdown on that first drive. Five punts, a missed field goal, a fumble, a turnover on downs, and a first down. Oh, Bradford. Finding his way. Touchdown in the first quarter. The only offensive score for either team tonight. Pirates makes that stop. Actually, Vinny Pirates is down on the feet. The second time tonight might be another crank. Said that big. Oh, we have an Oh, wow. What am I playing with that? Fagan's scooped up in the third quarter. Thompson's lone touchdown of the night. Advantage who here at this juncture? I would say it's the time. Honestly, we're in a defensive stalemate. This is the type of game that we kind of expect. Both of these teams are really strong on defense. We're seeing both of those defenses shine outside of the first drive from the Thompson defense. I think their defense has been really good ever since that point. Thompson, Jared Smith, making his presence known on that defensive front, the Auburn commit. Chance Strong is in four. Pyrus leaves with that grab. Burgess over the middle. That is in and out of the hands. Nearly picked off. Intended for Taylor. Demonte Tab might have had it in his arms, and now he's got a picked up leg. Offensive line did a great job of giving him time right there. It was just a little too far behind to the receiver Taylor right there. Just a little bit. If he get a little bit more in front, it's an easy first down. Just with the handoff. Again, that's Turner. Turner fighting his way for a first down. They've been able to churn up some of these yards at times. They're doing it right now. Peter and Bill. They're on the stop. They're near midfield. Defensive man lost contain right there. And the running back did a great job of taking advantage of that. Burgess. Throw across his body. That's to eight. Taylor. Like Fleming on the stop. Close to a first down. Another player is down. Wow, another player is. Oh, wow. Trenchita. in the mid-70s here tonight in Alabama. Rams can still get you. Hydration breaks required for the first four weeks of the season in the state of Alabama for high school ball at around the six-minute mark of each quarter.
and Grayson coming off a season opening loss to Collins Hill where they had a 19-3 lead in the second half. Lost that game 20-19. And not started 0-2 in 11 years. There's Brian and company trying to avoid that here. Second down and one. They led 7-0 tonight. The better part of two and a half quarters. Ashton Turner in the backfield. Three receivers out. For the Rams, Keith Williams trying to lead the way blocking, but for the run, that's going to be a no, it could be close to the first tip. No, the street are there on the stop. And they are going to move the chain. First and ten, closing in on nine minutes to go here in the fourth. The Pirates back on the field for Thompson. Powers from Georgia and Alabama knotted up at seven. Off keeping his feet is Turner. Turner, that was Devontae Tab trying to get him down. Gain of seven here for Turner. See Nash to turn of the soccer with some good yard. Both these running backs are doing a great job. Turner and then also Bradford making that first guy miss and creating some extra opportunities. Sophomore out, sophomore Bradford is back in. He makes some yards. That's going to be another first down. Cam Pritchett on the stop, gain of five. Once again, success up the middle. Grayson's doing a heck of a job of running the ball directly in the team. But the Thompson defense, and they had a lot of success just simply running inside zone. Up the middle, you saw Pirates was the first man in there on the stop for a minimal gain on Bradford. Larry's trying to get the crowd fired up. Yeah. A little different concept right there, Grayson. Starting to run some GT counter, just getting the guard and the tackle out, getting those big bodies in space. Your defensive tackle, Noah Streeter, is on the ground now for Thompson. It has been a war in the trenches tonight. This battle of perennial powers, Georgia and Alabama. Thompson and Four consecutive Class 7A state championships until last season. Just two losses last season. By a combined five points, one coming in the state championship game to Central Phoenix City. A stop or maybe a defensive score, something. 11th play of this drive. You can see the wear and tear by this Thompson defense that has been asked to do a lot here tonight. Josh Thomas is now on the field in the backfield for Grayson. It's the handoff, and he is not getting out of the grass. But Jared Smith Pyrus was the second man in, loss of one. Big play by the Pirates came flying down here. Jerry Smith did an outstanding job right there across the base and making a play in the backfield, too. Third down and long here for Grayson. Stafford and Taylor in the near side receiver. Ashton Turner in the backfield on this third down and 11. Tie game about seven minutes to go. Burgess near side and nearly pulled down and in by Aiden Taylor, but broken up by Thompson. Micah Fleming with a PBU for down. And Richard providing some pressure. Last play, Jared Smith, the Auburn commit. 
making the stop. They're going for it on fourth down. One for two tonight on fourth down by the Grayson Rams. Burgess over the middle, an early contact. They want a flag, no flag. Intended for Trey Watkins, the third, and another turnover on down. Tavius Bryant said, how is that not a penalty? We'll take another look in a little bit. But Cam Pritchett providing the pressure, getting emotional on the sidelines. He needs his Thompson offense to get going. Seven minutes to go in this tie game. Name one.